What's going on, people? This is your boy Wanzo coming back to you with another video. Yeah, this is my third take on this video. Um, I keep keeps getting interrupted, I'm starting to get aggravated. <laughs> um, so I'm hopefully I can knock this one out again on you know this one try here. Um, th the point of this video is going to be I'm going to be talking about SHA 256, basically Bitcoin. Um, I'm getting questions about, you know, if I think it's a good time to buy an S9 or should they wait for the new generation or should they wait for the mystical S11 from Bitmain, not to be confused with the other one. Um, and in my opinion, you for the price of the S9 right now, it, it can almost not be beat. There's one that gets really close, okay? And and depending on your way of thinking, maybe it does beat it. So I'm gonna give you my view. I'm gonna be comparing, I'm gonna be comparing Antminer S9, Halong T2, the Dragon Mint T2 that they've announced. I'm gonna be comparing these two machines Okay, to to the uh, ASIC Miner Compact Nano Eight. It's an eight nanometer chip miner that's produced by the ASIC Miner Company. All right, this is it right here, and um, it, like I said, it's eight nanometer chip. Um, the T two is ten nanometer chip, and we all know that the um, yeah that the uh, S eleven is 16 nanometer all right so i'm gonna run through this um hopefully not too quick but you know as as easy as i can so basically what i'm what i'm doing here is i'm comparing dollar for dollar the asic miner compact 8 the nano 8 cost 6100 dollars shipped to my house with a psu i calculated two Dragon Mint T2s, and I'm using the price that they had for the T1 because shipped to my house, it was $3,099 with a PSU, which I thought was a ripoff. So I'm using that price for the T2 because there still isn't a price released. It's going to be at least this or more. And we all know that the uh, the Antminer um, S9 is... $1,010, and you can use a high-value coupon as high as $420 um, to buy one, bringing that cost down to $770, and then you can add whatever you paid to the cost to that price. So let's just say you bought a, a $420 coupon for 100 bucks, Add $100 to the $770. So then you come up with $880, and that's what I did here. Because honestly, I would not pay more than a hundred bucks for a four hundred and twenty dollar coupon. Um, it's, if you pay more than that, then it really doesn't make sense to, you know, to, you know, the the point is to have an advantage, you know. And because these are just virtual, virtual coupons, then honestly, I mean, I think a hundred dollars is more than you know fair um, for one. So anyway, that's just my opinion. I mean, some of y'all probably do it a different way. So. I've compared here um, seven, seven S9s that'll give you a total of, of 98,000 giga hash or 98 tera hash. It's 9,240 9, watts, my, my uh, kilowatts, pool fees, and the cost for the seven units comes out to 690. Calculate that and you're looking at 460 days to break even. You're looking at thirteen dollars and twenty-two cents profit. Uh, you're looking at thirty-five fifty in electricity, and your total revenue would be forty-eight seventy-one. All right. Now that's the S nine. Now, the uh, the Dragon Mint T two from either Halong or InnoSilicon is uh, sixty-one ninety-eight. It packs 34,400 34, giga hashes. Um, it's 3,080 watts, and those are my electricity and the pool fees. So let's calculate. 
Now we're looking at 1,176 days to break even. You're looking at a profit of you're looking at a profit of uh, 520, 527, and your electricity is going to be 1183, and your total revenue is 1710. Okay, um, I I honestly don't think that these units are worth it. You know, from Dragon Mint or Inno. Um, I would not recommend anybody to buy them, especially Inno, because, you know, I, ha I, have a, I have a real hardcore problem with their, you know, with their, you know, the way they handle customers and stuff and they suck. But that's enough. That's a, for another video. And um, the ASIC Miner Nano 8 Compact from, Inno, from uh, ASIC Miner Company is uh, 38 terahash or 38,000 giga hash uh, it's 2,000 watts and it costs sixty one hundred dollars so let's calculate and that includes shipping and um, a PSU you're looking at five hundred and forty four days to break even now that's not bad um, you know that gets close to the s9 the s9 still you know beats it but that's because of the coupons all right because if we were to you know take the coupons out of there I'm sure that number would be a lot higher so um, we're looking at a profit of eleven twenty one per day. You're looking at uh, electricity costs of seven sixty eight per day. Now this unit is really efficient. All right, it's about fifty four watts per terahash. I did the math already. Uh, Two thousand watts divided by thirty eight terahash equals fifty four fifty two point six watts per terahash. That's really efficient. These other two units are nowhere even close. The only reason I, th I think the ant miner still has an edge is because of the price and your ability to use a coupon. So I think that's the only reason that the ant miner stays ahead is because of that. So let's um, let's mess around with these numbers here. Let's just go to 15,000. You know, let's not screw around. Now you're looking at 115 days to break even, and you're looking at 52 bucks and 59 cents, 35, 48 in electricity, and your total revenue of 8807. Let's do the same thing here. 15,000. Uh, no, that's not the one. 15,000 right here. Sorry, guys. 15,000. So now we're at 324 days to break even. You're looking at 1909. 1183 and 3091 again I don't think these units are worth it and let's do the same thing here to the nano 8 15,000 so you're looking at 230 days to break even and you're looking at 2647 yeah so I think in my opinion even though the units are a lot more efficient inefficient all right dollar for dollar pound for pound terahash per terahash you can't beat the s9 you just can't um i i can see where you know people are saying oh but the new generation stuff i mean guys the new generation stuff is going to cost a lot more than what you will pay for an s9 i don't even think it's going to be anywhere close and we're going to be looking back on this video, and I'm probably going to touch base on this video, say, I don't know, four or five months from now. And I'm going to be, people are going to wish that they that they hopped on the S11, um, and the S9, excuse me. No, I'm getting confused. <laughs> um, people are going to wish that they bought an S9, you know, they bought S, S9s. And that's just, you know, the way it is. Because, like I said, dollar for dollar, you just can't beat it. Even though they're they're more efficient, I mean, just look look at the profits. I mean, even the, even the even the eight nanometer doesn't come close. Because the new generation miners, in my opinion, are not going to be. I think we're almost tapped out strength wise. Unless they make the unit bigger. I mean, kind of like what, you know, what ASIC Miner did. I think that 
we're almost tapped out what the chips can push power wise what i think was going to be going on here in the future is going to be how efficient can we make these chips how, can we squeeze some more watts you know out of it to make it more efficient and i think that's where we're going so in my opinion i honestly believe that i believe that um ant miner s9s are a better deal right now at this date and i think the numbers prove it you know we're looking at for the same money you would spend on two two dragon mint t2s and the same money that you would spend on one ASIC Miner Nano compact, you just can't you just can't fuck with it. I mean the numbers are right there. I didn't screw around with anything, um, so you know that's just my opinion, and um, you know we'll just see what happens. You know only time will tell. But um, you guys, let me know what you think. Do you think the S9 is a steal right now? Do you think that I've lost my marbles and the T2 is better or the 8 nano compact is better? Tell me. Join the Discord. Subscribe. You guys know what the fuck's going on. Peace. Peace.